Hi there, this is George from ICAM, and today we'll be looking at tool and fixture compensation options in Campost Quest. For this example, I'll be using a post configured for a 4-axis horizontal mill with a Fanuc 30i controller. Let's start by looking at the output of our post. First off, we see G54 to G59 commands being issued for work offset. You'll also notice that tool length compensation is not always applied on the first motion following a tool change. Let's find out why. We'll hit Ctrl F to find the load tool string in our input. As you can see, on line 38, we haven't defined an offset number. But scroll down and you'll see that on line 104, we have. We want to make sure that in case the length offset number is missing in the CL file, the post will use an offset number equal to the tool number. Then, we'll change the post settings that are currently outputting G54 to G59 commands for work offset. In our case, we'd rather have G54.1, P1, through G54.1, P9. Let's see how we can do that. First off, we open Control Description, Tool and Fixture Compensation. Then we select Use Tool as Default Offset. After that, in Fixture Compensation, we'll set the control method to offset as well. This means we'll have to create a new offset register to match our G54.1P1 syntax. In the special before box, I'll set G54.1 space P. If I test my settings, I see my output is currently G54.1 space P01. Let's get rid of this zero by hitting omit leading zero. And there we go. Now we'll simply select the register. Then OK. Now if we test this post again, we'll find work offset number 2 defined and length compensation applied automatically. In our next video, we'll be looking at LCS transformation and circular interpolation.